I hate to say it. I hate to say it, but that thing is going to get us killed, man. You are going to get us killed, little fella. You better be worth it. What is going on guys? Riot here playing Ark Survival Evolved back with the play as Dino Mod. Now a lot of you guys were requesting I play this again and a lot of it was because Primal Evolved is coming out sometime in like November I believe. Primal Evolved is going to be that whole new DLC where you get to like play as creatures and it's going to be the whole maps are going to be designed so you could like basically it's just going to be the most insane Ark thing ever in the world. But um, basically until that comes all we can do right now is the play as dino mod and like the four creatures you can breed make nests and have like babies as and everything are the compi, the raptor, the terra, and the freaking terror bird. The terror bird I haven't done yet since he has requested it so much I figure I'd come back here. And since terror birds largely spawn on scorched earth I figured this map would be way more fun to do it as. So yeah this just sounds like a hell of a good time right here. Let's find the terra build make sure to go in as a female or your junk won't work. This is gonna be cool, I can't wait to like, and this time, I always ditch the mate whenever I have the egg and then I just do it on my own. I'm, I'm keeping that bastard with me this time, because Scorched Earth is a violent place. See, these ones I always avoid because it, it looks too much like you're just a person riding on top of it. But the thing is, I'm not even sure how different Primal Evolve is gonna be from that. Okay, one thing, we're gonna start gathering hide for our freaking nest right here. Holy crap, the game is lagging. Which is so much easier now that we're in Terra, but we were a compi, it was awful. Especially with all these little hide balls laying around the map. Or Jerboas, as you guys might call it, but they're perfect hide balls. That was just easy. Look at that. Oh my goodness gracious. We could just easily make a hide or nest already. Let's craft three nests. Just because in case we're feeling extra fertile, you know. You never know what kind of guy we're gonna have to meet at the end of this. God, I love how terror birds can just glide down too. Life is just cut out for them. Although, where's the highest amount of terror birds located? Because we have to find a male. That's like the first step here. A huge bitch of it's usually gathering, um, gathering hide for a nest. That right there just took care of like everything. That was amazing. So yeah, definitely, definitely cannot wait for Primal Evolved. So depending on how many creatures we'll even be able to, um, be right off the bat. I just, I can imagine me just getting a different survival series going for like every single creature. And I know I'm not alone. Freaking Median and Thomnia feel the same way, which makes me think all other ARC YouTubers do as well. I'm gonna make a shit ton of nests. See, I'm just gonna make a nesting ground. Like, no purpose whatsoever, since I can only lay one egg, but... I don't know, it'll work out. Are we in each other's... Really, we're not in each other's... Food chain? I feel like there should be some conflict right here. I guess terror birds are generally not... Foes of raptors? I think they all just kind of pick on the player. Is what's going on? I'm kind of making a point to eat all the jerboas I pass. Is there easy XP? Give me a little bug. I really don't want to piss this guy off. That'll be my life. Just a lonesome female. Come here, buddy. They're just rats. As a giant bird, I can't help but eat them. They look too much like they basically are prehistoric rodents, which would be like primary target for this guy. We really haven't leveled up though. That is just shameful. I don't know what I'm doing with all these nests. I'll know once I have enough. One thing too, for those of you wondering what's gonna happen to this mod when the freaking play as Dino, or not when the, when the, um, when the Primal Evolved DLC comes out, and I was actually reading up on it, apparently the, the freaking mod will not be abandoned, like, they're just gonna work on different things, other ways to make it even cooler, which was awesome to read, because this is like, I feel like a lot of work went into this, because I remember when this mod first came out, and it was like, actual ridiculous, and what, you were very, very clearly just a person riding a dinosaur, but then you could be like, smaller things that you can't even ride, and it all develops so beautifully. Terror bird! Oh my god. My people! My people, yes! Yes! This is what I've been waiting for! What are you? Huh? What's up, buddy? What gender? Nope, you're definitely a male. No! Don't do it, Cardo. Don't be that guy. Don't do it. Just let us procreate how... I don't even know who intended. We've got this. I've got him pinned on a rock. This is love at first sight right here. This is how it should be. We're in a very hostile area too, so I think I'm gonna have to leave this guy, which is gonna suck. But I do have an egg. It is a very shiny, nice pink little egg. Alright there, basically just tamed him for the sake of having an ally in this. I feel like that was necessary. There's no great, there's no like better way to do it so far, as far as this mod goes. We're gonna have to wait for Primal Evolve to come out for actual realism stuff to apply. Now where the hell... If I was a terror bird, I feel like I'd want to have my kids near water. Although I feel like water is kind of a hot spot for terror. But we are terror birds. So it's irrelevant. Those little caddy shacks way out in front of us in the middle of the sand dunes. If that's not, I'm pretty sure that's where so and so had Jesus, right? In that barn or something like that. Easy. Easy! It's going down over there. I feel for those wolves as a creature that's not much greater than them. 
Well, look at this guy. Just, there's just a couple out for a stroll. Everything looks so much different when you're the creature yourself. All right, the scorpion might give us issues. I say we kill him. Or should we leave him here? We do get along with everybody. We are. Let's just get him. Get out of my land, you bastard. I can't trust it. Yeah, that's right. My husband will kick your ass. <laughs> All right, please don't don't, don't, don't put either of us to sleep. That would be so crappy right now. Right, this one's strong ass scorpion. Anybody going to sleep? Okay, no, we're fine. He should be fine too, right? My defender. What are we doing if a sandstorm picks up? We're kind of just screwed, aren't we? I feel like that's a thing. Oh, wait, no, I'm supposed to rub out use. Whoa! How big is this nest? What are we looking at here? Meh. It's kind of... I don't really want to have my kid on in water, though. That's kind of... I feel like that's bad parenting. Or is it? I've never had baby birds before. I've actually never had human kids before either, but this one feels a little bit a bit more foreign. Yeah, it's a good enough spot. It doesn't get any better than that. Stand directly on it. Nicely done, ma'am. No! Holy crap! Oh, I thought we ate it for a second. We very much so might have. I think I think the bird just ate the frickin' that. Damn it! I terrible parenting! You ate your kid, you horrible mother. Alright, so good news, bad news. Good news is we have the baby. Bad news is there's a storm going on. And this time, I'll do my best not to eat it. Although, I can't say it might not happen. They are... This is just so tempting to eat your child. There we go. Look at that pink polka dot egg in there. Looking sexy as hell. That is what's up. You, you see this? Rick, look what we've created. Rick's a bastard. He doesn't even care. Rick's kind of an alcoholic. I should have chosen better. I think I might be getting too far into this. Now, you, we could either let bless the child with your beautiful present. I don't know. Let's just eat him. Well, it's just a, we're terror birds, not like lovely birds. Yeah, there's no purpose to that. One thing that's weird is I'm kind of like pounding a Red Bull right now because I didn't get very, like I barely got any. What? The egg has magically transported from there to there. How does that even make sense? Holy crap, never put down a nest once you have an egg growing. For this kind of mu- What, what kind of black magic is this? <laughs> this egg, it has powers. I'm so damn confused right now. I basically put down another egg because we, while I was waiting here, he impregnated me again is basically what happened. And I put it down and then the first egg disappeared. This is the second egg. But then I look over and there's an egg in this. This is it. This was the one. That doesn't make any damn sense at all. We got like some teleporting. The eggs are teleporting from nest to nest. It's freaking me out. What would this little guy be thinking? Seriously. Like you're, so, I feel like your survival instincts would keep any small rodent-like creature far away from... Birds of terror. Look at you just we would just rip you apart. You're gonna be baby's first meal, little guy. That's what's gonna happen here. Yeah, let, let the dad take care of that. You gotta go out there. Oh yeah, and I'll clean up the damn mess every freaking time. I swear to god we're leaving the second that kid can take care of himself. Or I'm leaving you. That's what I meant to say. There's how are my babies doing? This thing is taking forever. I've been here for like 20 minutes. It's pretty nuts. Oh my god, get over here, your kid is about to hatch and you're not even present for it. This, he's gonna remember this when you're older. You need, you need him to wipe your ass. Or, yeah, that, well that, that'll hopefully never be a thing. Evolution should take care of that, I mean not evolution, social Darwinism. We'll get eaten long before we have someone to need to wipe our butts. I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. Just came for this kid to hatch. I've been here, waiting for this little bastard to graduate from college for so long. It's like about to happen any second. I assume I have like a few other eggs in my inventory too. We've we've had to keep busy, if you know what I'm saying. I gotta say, terror birds might have the cutest eggs. Like I'm, I know it's a judgment call, and it's like political to even have an opinion on such things. But oh, little fart! God, he is tiny. He is itty bitty, dude. Look at that little guy. What the hell? How do you survive? He looks like those weird little frog monster things and Pikmin that eat all the Pikmin. It's exactly what it looks like. Go ahead and eat up, little guy. Look at this. This is beautiful. This is a beautiful thing we got going on here. This is what all parents of terror birds... What is the kid eating? He's eating something. No way. He's he's alive. You don't understand why this is so weird. I pooped you out of my butt. I'm like a machine. Alright, let's get the whole family on the move. Try to make it down to the watering hole, shall we? Luckily, nothing really attacks us. But our baby can't really keep... Oh my god, are you going to be a pain in the ass? I know you were born five minutes ago, but are you going to hold us up right now? 
Because that is ridiculous. I suppose dad would just stay home with the baby. Is that how that would go down? No, I think it'd be mom. Actually, I'm confused. I'm confused on, <laughs> on basic gender roles. I think the only thing we really have to worry about is like T-Rexes, which should just be in the mountains back there. I think they occasionally wander the plains, but that's only occasionally. The kid is so damn slow! I hate to say it, I hate to say it, but that thing is gonna get us killed, man. You are gonna get us killed, little fella. You better be worth it. You better be awesome when you grow up. Okay, I just fed him like all I possibly can. He's, his inventory would be extremely full of food right now if we checked. I'm, sh I'm confident about that. I just put him back into the water with nothing going wrong. Or wait, would golems mess with us? I feel like that would be kind of a thing. Or elementals, I mean. Oh, hey, uh, look at that. Letting out the signal. Snap. Anyone who's interested. That's kind of slutty. Okay. I want to venture into these mountains a tiny bit, actually, where all the elementals and T-Rexes are to see if they have the nerve to attack this new newborn family. Where the hell did he go? I feel like we could finish this guy off. There's no reason to do it other than the fact that we can do it, which ultimately is the only reason to do anything ever. Where's our little buddy? There he is, way back there, hanging out with a saber. I would not trust that, but it looks like he's, like, off the radar. That saber's a mighty gentleman, and that kid is slow as- okay. Well, I think we can take him. I think we can take him. He's so weak already. If we focus- if we focus our firepower! Nope, you're gonna die. You're gonna- yeah! That's what I'm talking about right there. Look like a father and- so shit, saber's pissed. Like a mother and father coming together to kill a creature. In hopes of defending their child from something that was never really a threat. This guy might kill me. Holy crap. That was dangerous. Oh shit, we just got involved in a street fight. Hang on. Our beef is not with you, Kimosabi. Stick with me, family. Come on, we got this. We barely just avoid that. I just kind of hit the, the freaking thorny lizard, which just got its ass beat by this couple right here. What's going on? We're just trying to walk our kid. I just walked this kid like freaking 100 miles. Oh, crap balls. He does pop out. Oh my god, what bad timing. I'm behind the big fella. Shit! Oh my god, our baby just got squashed by a boulder! It does happen. That's my man in there fighting for his child who just got vaporized. And now another bird's gonna eat us as we're trying to freaking get- Holy shit! I can't believe we- Okay, you do not- You do not survive! That's what happens. See, you do gotta stay down by, away from the mountains. You gotta stay down by the creeks. This is a good lesson right here. It's exactly why I went up. I wanted to find out. It's true, you do die. <laughs> All right, so there's my last little warm-up before Primal Evolve comes out, since that's the last dinosaur, your prehistoric creature you can breed as and everything. The others aren't updated enough, but um, it should only be about a month, and then we're going to have a bunch of different series going on where a bunch of different creatures, and it's going to be insane. So, um, so yeah, definitely smack that like button, subscribe for more. That was the Play As Dino Mod, and have a nice day, guys. Peace! <laughs>